Hi there, this is just a quick tutorial about how to um, get rid of a background for a print and cut. It's more ideal really when you have a dark background. So I'll just show you the basics first. Uh, I'm just using the, the basic Silhouette Studio, no upgrade on it or anything. Um, so you've got your image and you go to your trace. And we need to cut the background out, so I'll pull the threshold up, so everything on the edge is pretty, that's too much. So that looks pretty decent. So we don't want to trace, we don't want to do that one, we want to trace and detach. So hopefully, there we go, background is removed. And our image is there. Now with darker ones, it's slightly different because when I trace, as you'll see, it'll pick up this, the dark. It let it prefers the dark. See, it picks all this, but it picks all, all this up. So what you want to do is, ah, there we go. I kind of get rid of all these lines, just so all that black is covered. And it's the same thing, trace and detach. And we detach the background. So that's, like I said, it's ideal if you're doing a print and cut. Because you don't want to, especially if you've got a coloured background, you don't want to have to print all that out. So you'd need your registration marks. And once you've placed it, don't move it. Once it's placed and you've printed. But don't forget to, you have to retrace it. So you would trace, well you only usually want your outline when you're doing a print and cut, so let's just do that. So you should have red lines, don't move your image, you can always double check things, and then you would send. And it's as simple as that. Works on most backgrounds, you might just have to adjust the sliders depending on the colour. Um, and sometimes if things like this or also the background you have to go in again so you were you would do that but if you wanted this then you would kind of trace the smaller area like this fill that in and detach that and then it should be pulled out so hopefully let's give you the basics basically trace something and trace and detach thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to the channel I shall be adding some more tutorials uh, soon.